Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix error code 100 or 102 or if you're receiving error code 501, there was a connection error. So if you're receiving these kind of errors, then please follow the steps shown in this video. Now the first step is to restart Steam. Just restart Steam and then relaunch Steam and then check. If that does not work, restart the computer once and after the system restart, launch the game. Next step is to rename this uh, rename the game folder in this location now first of all create a backup because you may lose all the game progress you have to start everything from scratch so create a backup first so open file explorer go to this pc open c drive now open users folder now open your username folder now open app data folder if you don't see app data at the top click on view select show put a check on hidden items and then open app data folder open local low folder over here you can see sci games folder open this folder and over here you can see this game folder so you can create a backup first so copy this folder paste it to the desktop once you have a backup created now you can make a right click and then you can rename this folder once you rename it the game will start from scratch now also let me inform you the game may not work if you have had the JP version also known as DMM installed on your computer. So you have to uninstall DMM. Also go to the launcher menu at the bottom right corner and repair game data. Now for this you can launch the game first. Now on this screen click on these three horizontal lines and then over here you can see repair data. So click on repair data and then read this if you agree then click on OK. And once this is done now you can you can relaunch the game and then check still not working the next step is to run the game from the game install installation folder so instead of launching the game from here make a right click on the game select manage click on browse local files this will take you to the game installation folder make a double click launch the game from here and then check still not working make a right click then go to properties go to this tab put a check on the box which says run this program as an administrator hit apply click on ok make a double click launch the game and then check still not working Go to properties once again, go to this tab, put a check over here, select Windows 8, hit apply, click on OK, launch the game. If that does not work, you can even select Windows 7 over here, hit apply, click on OK, launch the game and then check. Still not working, put a check on disable full screen optimization, hit apply, click on OK and then launch the game. Now, when you put a check on all these boxes, still not working, in that case you can uncheck these boxes and then hit apply, click on OK, follow the next step. Now, the next step is to now, if you're using any kind of third party antivirus program, like if you have Avast, Norton, Bitdefender, McAfee, whichever antivirus program you're using, allow the game exe file or the complete game folder to your antivirus program. If you're using Windows security, in that case, you can open Windows settings, go to privacy and security, and then click on Windows security. Now click on virus and threat protection. Scroll down at the bottom, you will see manage ransomware protection now click on allow and allow an app through control folder access click on yes to allow click on add an allowed app click on browser apps now go to the game installation folder so in my case the game is installed in this location and then open the game folder so this is the location go to this location and then select the game exe file and then click on open now type in control panel in windows search box and then go to control panel go to system and security Windows Defender Firewall, click on allow an app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall, click on change settings, click on allow another app, click on browse and then go to the game installation folder once again and then open the game folder, select the game exe file, click on open and then click on add. In my case the ga game is already added. So once the game is added over here, now you can launch the game and then check. Now you can also go to virus and threat protection and then uh, let's click on manage settings and over here you can see exclusion add or remove exclusion so you can just click on yes to allow click on add and ex exclusion and then folder and then you can go to the game installation folder open the game folder Select the complete game folder and then click on select folder. So add an exclusion over here. Similarly, 
if you have any third party antivirus you have to add the complete game folder to the exclusion list now if you're using eset security in that case you can add the game folder to hips exclusion rule now you will find this option in this location go to exclusion and add the complete game folder and then you can launch the game now if you're using cloudflare warp you can turn it off this has worked for many players so it might work for you next step is to turn on or turn off vpn so for many user using vpn has worked so if you uh, if you can you can use vpn and you can change uh, like uh, you can use the vpn and then check you can change the country and then check and if you are already using vpn still you are facing the problem in that case you can turn off the vpn also try different network so if you if you have any other network available uh, you can switch to different network and then you can check now if you have any like you can also use mobile hotspot so turn on the data on your phone and then once you turn on the data turn on the hotspot on your phone and then over here you can connect to your phone network so you will see your phone network over here you can connect to your phone network and then you can launch the game you can also switch to ethernet connection so if your computer has a ethernet port and if you have a ethernet cable uh, you can connect using the wired connection and then check next step is to run this command these commands are provided in the video description so type in cmd in windows search box make a right click on command prompt app and then click on run as administrator make sure that you open command prompt as an administrator click on yes to allow now copy these commands one by one so copy this and then paste it over here hit the enter key now run the second command paste it over here hit the enter key now run the third command paste it hit the, hit the enter key so run all these commands one by one Once this is done, now restart your computer. Restart your computer, and after the system restart, you can launch the game and then check. Still not working. The next step is to verify the game files. To verify the game files, you can go to Steam, make a right click on the game, select properties, go to Install Files tab, and then click on Verify Integrity of Game Files. Once the verification is 100% complete, launch the game and then you can check. So one of the steps shown in this video should help you to fix this error. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.